This is the 2002 Beridua Kalisa and it's one of the fastest cars alongside the Bugatti Chiron in the world. Tonight, Kai is in London. The cup is stuck and I have a V12. Around two decades ago, Peridot decided to name a car after a fish called the Arowana. The model I have here is the 2002 limited edition model fitted with all the bells and whistles like leather seats, a two-tone colour scheme and a broken radio. Cars like the Kalisa are not really known for their luxurious interior, but at least with this one, you don't really feel broke. You feel more like brocade with a pinch of elegance. The Kalisa has a total of 56 horsepower, which is around 75 Newton meters of torque, or around 3 horses, or for our American friends, 1 8th of a Ford F 150. You know what? Enough chit chat, let's have a drive, shall we? Come join us. The Kalisa can do not to 60 in an impressive 14.8 seconds and has a top speed of 140 km per hour or for our American friends, two-thirds of a bald eagle. Absolutely bonkers! I can feel the torque. You can really feel the torque and the energy from this car. It shoots just like a missile. Alright, so now we're in the Wangan Highway and let's test out the Kalisa speed. If there's one word to describe this car, it would be mechanical because everything in this car feels very well put together. Yeah, it might not have a Bluetooth player or it might not have keyless entry, but what we do have is a very functional, economical and fun car. So I was thinking the other day, one horse costs around 1,500 ringgit per month to maintain. A Kalisa on the other hand costs around 150 ringgit per month, but you get two extra horses. What a bargain. Now, let's look at the perks and features. Truth. Although this car is an engineering marvel made by Daihatsu Engineering, it misses out on the most important part of a car, the cup holder. As you can see here, you can put a cup inside, but once you put it in P, you can't take it out. Another quirk that the Kalisa has is the steering wheel. The steering wheel doesn't have any power steering, so you can think of it as a workout for your arm. This is not a bug, this is a feature. Moving on to security feature. Well, no one's gonna steal this car. And my favourite feature of all... Electronic windows. So, what are my thoughts on this car? In my opinion, the Kalisa is one of the best cars you can probably buy. It removes all the unnecessary distractions of a modern day car. And what you're left is just the sound of the 3 cylinder engine. Do I recommend buying it? Absolutely yes. Thank you for watching. Like and subscribe and I'll see you next time. Alright, so we're going to be testing out the acceleration of the Kalisa. Oh my god, absolutely bonkers. 